Good morning again, everyone. Our search for the best pies around the state continues on the weekend. Last week, we visited Anne Lapierre at her home in Colchester. She won the Champlain Valley Fair's pie contest. Yes, yeah, so this time around, our tour is taking us north to the Franklin General Store. Now, it's a place that sells hundreds of pies mm. each and every year, and the maple cream is the star. It's the big seller, and that's what we're making this morning on the weekend. Great. This morning, I'm in the Franklin General Store with Sue Mayo. You may remember her from our country tour series back in the weekend a couple of years ago. And when I was doing that story, you guys had a ton of pies. So yes, I thought we this did. is the perfect place to come for the pie tour. We have uh, around nine varieties. Wow. A lot of pies. A lot of pies. And with pies, it all starts with a good crust. What it goes does. into it? Well, this here is uh, flour, and then you're shortening, and you mix that up, and then you add in your cold water, your eggs, and some vinegar. So you get your dough, mm -hmm. and of course you got to roll it out next. How yeah. does that work? Okay, so you're just going to take a ball of dough and kind of shape it. How many of these have you rolled out through the years? Uh, quite a few. Quite a <laughs> few. And then you just fold it in half, stick it on your pie tin, and then you just kind of shape it in here. This is the uh, finished product after you bake it. And awesome. you can see where it's got all the little poke holes to uh, keep the air going through there so it doesn't uh, collapse on you. Now that the pie shell is done, we've moved over to the stove because we're making um, what today? Maple cream pie. That sounds awesome. Yeah, that's one of the favorite pies here at all, the store. All right, so what goes into this? Well, we're going to start off with some butter. So if you can all just right. hand me I can butter. hand you that. Okay. We're going to put our butter in here and we have to melt the butter. All righty. Where did this recipe come from? This recipe actually came from the previous owners of the Franklin General and mm -hmm. it was sold with the store. Oh, so like when you signed the, the dotted line, so it was yeah, part this, of the agreement? That, this uh, recipe with stays it. with the store and continues with the store after we're, we're finished. Yeah, and that's why we're not getting specifics today, you, only the gist yeah, of things, right? Yeah, just the gist of things, All yeah. right. Can you hand me the cup of flour there? All right, so you're basically making a roux here. Right? We are, yeah. So we're going to just uh, put this in and you want to stir it with your whisk until it's nice and smooth. And then we are going to add the maple syrup. You if you want to just pour syrup, that right in there. No, we Look don't. Look at this. Yeah, this is, and this is local maple syrup too. It looks like a nice uh, golden amber color. You have to spoon it into your pie shells. So that what we did today is enough for two. Okay. So we just kind of even it out. I'm sure you built some muscles through the years. We uh, have, all yeah. This. <laughs> So now that the filling is in, this maple cream pie needs some cream. So what do you uh, do for that? Well, we have a cream that we use here at the Franklin General. Um, this is a cream that we really like. You can use any cream that you want. But you're not giving your wife a secret on this either, uh, right? No, this is a staple here, and uh, that, that stays with the pie. Okay. And that's the good. finished product. You can see how nice the filling down below is set, really nice and thickly. So, some days like this, I just love my job. <laughs> this is great. Oh, it's so creamy. Yeah. And it just oozes maple. Yeah. And yeah, and it's nice to have that texture with the crust on the bottom. This is very, very good. Good. Well, good. thank you, you for like sharing it. this, and I guess I'm going to have to come back for more one of these days because we can't quite squeeze that full recipe oh, out Okay. Of well, you, you know, you can't be upset that a pie lady wants to keep her secrets. Right. Because, I mean, yeah, I mean, they, they pay dearly for that recipe by <laughs> buying the store, obviously. So as we mentioned, of course, the exact recipe, you can't quite get mm -hmm. it out of her. But if you want to try the pie for yourself, they run eleven ninety five, and they're always at the store. And mm -hmm. so we're planning on doing a pie story, of course, across every yeah, county in our tour. state. And we're just getting going here. So we continue to ask you for your ideas. If you have them, send them in via email, Facebook, however you want. I know. I love this. Yes, yeah, little graphic. pies yeah, little showing pies. up all over the state. It's For been sure. fun, definitely. And oh, maple anything. Mm -hmm. You know me, I love that. 